Hey guys and happy Sunday. On today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I got this ponytail up on my head and how I got this gold coil around my head and how I did the whole process. Today's ponytail is by Newborn Free. Uh, yeah, Jumbo Effie 0344. And the color is 1B. And I did a pre-pool yesterday. I used Motions. Uh, moisture plus conditioner mixed with herbal essence and jojoba oil and I did that before I shampooed my hair um, pre poos are great to add moisture back to your hair it's also great for a detangler and it's also great for using after you shampoo your hair so I shampooed my hair with Shea Moisture's raw Shea Butter uh, Moisture Retention Shampoo this is a non sulfate shampoo uh, my hair was sort of dry, so I did not want to dry it out more by using a sulfate shampoo. And then after I got through shampooing my hair, I didn't want to condition it again, so I just put this leave-in conditioner in. This is by Blue Magic. It's an Oregon Oil Herbal Complex, and it's very hydrated. When I styled my hair yesterday, I used the... Well, I had actually put some oil in my hair, too. So I had put a little bit of hair grease in my hair. This is by Blue Magic. This is the Super Sure Grow has hair on it gross and I styled it I used this curly cream um, curly curl cream by Talia YG just to have some kind of structure to the flat twist so you'll see what I've done uh, yesterday today I got up because I didn't know what I was gonna do with my hair I was looking like the predator so I said what am I gonna do with this hair so I did I decided to go on and just throw this ponytail on top and before I did, I used this um, pink glosser. And this adds a little bit of sheen to your hair without alcohol. And I used this um, Dr. Miracles for, yeah, Dr. Dr. Miracles Temple and Nape Growth Balm for my edges because it's great to grow your hair and slick my hair down. So I had a hard time styling my hair. Uh, I'm not used to styling my hair anymore because I've become lazy these last few years. So you'll see how I'm fumbling around and stuff like that. But I did get this. I did get this drawstring. This is a drawstring pony. I did get this drawstring pony up there. And it took me a while. But yes, it paid off. And so I'm loving it. I like how it's two strings here. But then there is a crisscross on this side. So it took me a while to get the, the, um, the cord string on my head too. I'll have everything in the description box so you can look it up. Uh, I got the cord string from my local beauty supply house and it didn't cost that much money so I hope you guys like this video I am doing something different I don't normally style my hair I am a hair care channel so every once in a while I'll try to get creative and style my hair and this is what I came up with so all I'm doing in this part of the video is sectioning my hair with a comb and then eventually I just start using my fingers because I wasn't feeling the comb anymore so I'm just doing a free form type style I hope I pronounced that properly, free form, which means I'm just going free. However it lands, however the parts are, that's how it's going to be. So sometimes I'll use the comb and sometimes I'll just use my fingers. But what I'm just doing is just adding the uh, leave-in conditioner by Blue Magic, which is the Oregon, Oregon um, Herbal Complex. And I'm adding a little bit of hair grease on top of that so that I can have a nice moisture balance. And then I'll put in the Talia Wajid um, hair product to, you know, give my hair a little bit of a shape with the twist and stuff like that. So that's all I'm doing in this part of the video. And um, I'm just actually flat twisting my hair up in an angle so I can put my hair in a potential updo or a ponytail. And that's it.
guys, so it's the next day. It's Sunday and I woke up looking like this. Uh, I'm gonna put some gloss in my hair. I looked at the footage of my hair yesterday, how I uh, twisted it and it looks like the Predator. And I don't know what I'm going to do with this hair. So I have two ideas. I'm gonna see if I can maybe try to pin this hair up. Or I might have to throw on a little fake ponytail. I don't know guys. We'll have to see how this is going. Now, the sun is starting to shift. I'm not liking the way my bathroom lighting is looking, but I have to use my big mirror and my little mirror to be able to see the front and the back of my head. So this is the question of the day. Do you guys like to style your hair while you're standing or while you're sitting? I like to do both, but like styles, I have to see the back of my head and stuff. I like to stand, so I'll do both. And um, so the glosser that I use today is by Luster's Pink. And this doesn't have alcohol in it. So it adds some nice shine and it doesn't dry your hair out. So I didn't want to put some more grease back on here. Let's talk about these edges for a minute. What's going on here? They are starting to grow out of nowhere. And I was thinking, what have I been doing lately? Because I have not been putting any product to help them grow. I have not been doing anything different other than shampooing my hair more often. So I shampoo my hair now like every week and a half to two weeks. So that's the only thing I can think of by me, you know, shampooing and massaging my hairline. Maybe that's what's stimulating it to grow. Um, I got everything over here, but I want to talk to you guys. This gonna fall. I hope it doesn't fall. Um, but I want to talk to you guys briefly about edges. Somebody told me, and I think a lot of people think this, that edges don't supposed to grow. Edges is the beginning of your actual hair. So I knew when these grew back in, it was gonna be really full. This supposed to be the same length as this. But for those who don't know, I, my um, tree braid, or I had some tree braids uh, back in 2013. She braided my hair so tight around my edges to where they just would not grow. They broke off, they bald, and they, the growth just got stunt. So I don't go get my hair braided anymore. I don't let anybody put their little mitts in my head anymore. But they're trying to grow back, and I don't know if, if I should... If I should cut them while they're like this or when I straighten my hair. I don't know, they look crazy, but at least I'm getting some more hair. So I, yeah, I had traction alopecia. Traction alopecia comes from too much tight, tight hairstyles like this. So ballerinas get it, uh, girls who wear tight braids, ponytails, all this stuff right here you girls and guys doing, don't do that if you don't want any edges. All right, so anyway, well, do it if you don't want any edges. Don't do it if you want your edges. Yeah. So now that I got that out the way, let's see what we're gonna do with this Predator hairstyle. So I did let it air dry. And when I woke up, I was predatorial. Predatorial. What are we gonna do? So I got some hairpins. I got some little, I got some stuff over here. Should I take this? I don't know what the hell. I really need to redo this one. I don't know. Should I take this down? So, let me see something. Maybe I'll get some inspiration from this little thing I was supposed to put in my hair <laughs> about two, two or three years ago. This is the Newborn Free Ponytail Jumbo Effie. 1B and the number is 0344. Effie, are you gonna work for me, girl? Cause I don't even know how to do stuff like this. This is why I don't style my hair. So if you don't know, my, my, cha Ooh, my channel is really based on hair care. It's not based on hairstyles. And I know some people say, well, that's all you do is just talk about you and your, and your hair. 
why don't you how come you don't do any do's and don'ts videos and how come you don't style your hair if you read my description of my channel you will see clearly that I don't say anything about no hairstyles I don't like styling my hair I used to like styling my hair but some kind of way I just lost interest so this is a <laughs> a baby afro throw that out one, out the one over there and it, it's a drawstring baby afro I don't know I don't even know what the name of this video. I'm gonna turn it off. How do you even do a drawstring? I meant to look on line first before I even got on camera today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I am not feeling this lighting at all. So, what are we gonna do? Let me get my mirror. When you don't know what when you don't know what to do, you just wing it. So we gonna wing it. All right. I think I'm gonna try the ponytail. I got a ponytail over here. I need to probably brush it. I was going to try to pin this up into an updo. But I don't know if I feel like that. I could. No, let's try something else. I don't like the word. I don't like where that ponytail landed. I like my ponytail to sit up higher on my head because I don't like for my head and hair to touch the headrest in the back. I don't like nothing touching me. Not nothing. I don't like anything touching me. I just did these twist free form. I didn't hardly use a comb that much. I'm at the point in my life, I don't feel like trying to figure out how to make stuff neat on the top of my head. Hairpins. You'd be like, well, why don't you ever style your hair?
Okay, guys, so I'm gonna try to put this thing on. I don't know what the hell. It's got teeth in it. I guess that's where you're supposed to tuck it around your hair. What is this thing? It's a tag, too. So does that mean the tag go in the back? What? There ain't no tag. <sighs> so does this go? Okay, there's a big hole in the center, too. Right here. So maybe I'm supposed to put my hair in that hole. the drawstring. My hair is too big for this hole. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, I think I found the drawstring. I saw one girl whipping around like this. So I am going to pull this drawstring out around my ponytail and just tuck it. Then, what am I going to do with this here? I'm just gonna take these flat twists and I'm gonna tuck them around there too. And put some bobby pins, some hair pins in there. Uh -oh. And put some hair pins to tuck those twists. I don't know how I got this thing up here, but it's up there. Now, one thing your girl can do is she cannot style hair anymore. I have fallen out of styling my hair so much to her. I don't know what I'm doing. All right, so I finally got this thing up here. Let's lay down some edges. So I bought some more new Dr. Miracle um, Temple and Nate Balm. It's a grow, growth Nate Balm. This is what helped my edges the first time around when I first got started. So I like it because it's minty, it helps my hair grow, and it really does lay down these edges. So how are we going to do this? Let's go over here.
All right, so now that we got those edges laid, I mean, they are laid too. This, this, this edge control is really, really good. So now that we got those edges laid down, let's see if we can add some kind of color to this hair. You can't even see my twist. That's okay. So, let's see. I have some uh, filigree tubes. These little things here. And I'm not quite sure how to use them, but I guess it's probably as easy as they seem. So it has a little opening. I think. I thought it had openings. Mm, no. They don't have any openings. I don't know what I thought these were. So, I'll be back. So I got some braiding cord. Let's see what I can do with this. It's by Bloom. I got this from my local beauty supply house. It costs about $2 or $3. Just play around and see how this is going to go. Oh. How does that look? That's a crisscross. This is, oh, this is hard to do. Oh shit. I done messed up my hair in the back. All right, so let me go this way. Maybe it'd be easier for me to go this way. up my hair right here.
All right, let's try this again. I'm getting annoyed. These cores are not easy. Oh, okay. Well, I finally got in some kind of knot. So let me adjust this first. right here and it's a crisscross over here so we just gonna go with that because I don't know what else to do with this cord so I'm gonna take some hairpins and try to tuck this away this part here because what else am I gonna do with it I mean, <laughs> so I'm gonna get another hairpin here and try to tuck this away. Because I don't know what else to do with it. Let me open it up. Take this clip back down. I think we got something here, guys. I think we got something. I think we got something. So let me check the back of my hair. So 
let's put on some earrings and see how this works. So, I hope you guys like this video, and if you like this video, make sure you thumbs up and tell me what, what, how I could have done this a little bit easier, and that's it. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!